Hello everybody, in today's video I will show you how to insert or add footers or have different footers in uh, your document on Microsoft Office Word. So the first step that you have to do is uh, to open your Microsoft Word document. Here in this example I have a one page document. Let's insert uh, two page so I can show you how uh, to insert or to have different footer on your document or Microsoft Office Word. So now uh, let's have or let's add a footer. To do, uh, I have just to click or double click here on the bottom of the page. And as you can see, uh, it will uh, transfer us to the header and footer menu. Now I can add. Uh, first footer for example let's just uh, write whatever as you can see uh, I have the same footer uh, in the both page but I want uh, each page to have different footer to do so all you have is to uh, to insert or to have page sections uh, to insert a page section, all you have is to go to the layout menu here. As you can see, uh, after clicking on it, we'll find this menu here. We go to the page setup section, and in these choices here, we will find breaks. In the breaks, we can add a section break. In this example, I will have a continuous break. So it will uh, insert a break just after the text, because if I click uh, a next page, uh, next page uh, section break, it will add another blank page. Uh, as you can see, it's already added a blank page, but I don't want to. Uh, to see if you successfully uh, added the section page or the section break. All you have to go uh, to home and here in the paragraph section here you will find this symbol that says show or hide and click as you can see we already have our page break now uh, we can add our footer here as you can see now uh, it appears that each section has its own footer and header here the, uh, the footer of the section one and here the sections to footer but there is a little issue it is that the footers are linked as you can see here we have uh, the same as the previous footer if we change anything here it will be automatically changed here so to uh, undo this uh, to undo this all we have is to go to the section two or the next section's uh, footer and uh, go to the header and footer uh, menu or ribbon here. In the navigation section, we'll find these choices. As you can see, this is uh, the link of the footers. All we have is to deactivate it uh, until it's become decolored. As you can see, it doesn't have any color here. And also, uh, the message or the notification that says that uh, the footers are the same as previous now disappeared. Uh, now, uh, we will uh, write the first footer. And if we write something different, it won't change on the first one. Let's just uh, write second footer. And as you can see, we have different footers now. Also, we can just delete this freely without affecting the second footer. We can do this on another page. Let's just insert a new page, for example. Uh -huh. Now we would see the second footer because it is the uh, same as previous. Uh, no, we can. Ah, uh, we, because we have uh, to insert another section here on this page let's just have 
insert uh, layout the go breaks and for example continuous and here we will find a section three as you can see we will do as uh, exactly as the previous uh, steps we unlink the footers and we will have a third footer as you can see now we have three different footers here another footer as you can see this is another footer this is the second footer and this is the third one so this is how you add different footers on microsoft's office world thank you for watching and goodbye